Hey guys, it's the Soul Cloth here today, and so this is a monster analysis video. We are going to be going over the new Tales monster, Heister Keister, and we are going to be deciding whether or not he is worth getting. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so Heister Keister is going to be an attacker, and his traits are going to be control immunity, which is actually really good. Blind immunity and area random torture. So his rank 1 is really bad, but his other two are pretty good, especially rank 0. And then his relics are sword and trap, which are pretty good. And his pros and cons are right down here. His pros are neat trait and relic slots. He actually has a pretty good zero cooldown move as well. He's got solid speed and these tortures can quadruple in a harpy and could overwhelm. And his cons are shut down by torture immunity which is very true. A lot of his damage comes from his tortures. His big gimmick is like random torture abilities. And then he also has atrocious life which is true but you can always have a tank just block for him. And his moves have bad power which is also true but again most of his damage is going to come from his tortures. And and he has the lowest power out of all abyssal monsters and if we go on down to his moves he has a random torture extra turn he's got a random torture zero cooldown which is pretty great he also has a torture removal which applies two more tortures in its place so he can remove the torture so that you put on the enemy and then put two in its place which is really great so it like multiplies tortures and then he also has a random torture with a random and negative effect he has an aoe random torture removal and then two random tortures get added per the tortures removed and then he also has a aoe random torture times two so you could use that and then use this and then you just like double the tortures you can basically just double tortures on the enemies which is very very good so yeah he's a really fun monster he's got some really interesting moves and his whole gimmick is really cool i like it a lot so yeah definitely go and try to get him try to use him try him out he is inside of the tails challenge so he will cost a few gems but i do think that he is actually worth it so yeah that is going to be for this video don't forget to like share and subscribe more videos like this and i'll see you guys in the next one goodbye